Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to talk about the alignment of Highway 2000 and the fact that the alignment between Williamsfield and Hodges in St. Elizabeth. Now, a lot of persons thought that road would go closer to the Balaclava side through the, the lands owned by the Railway Corporation, basically more inland and following more the track of the railway lines. But when it was announced earlier this year, I think it was last month, that the highway was going to be built, it, it's persons or it, when it was announced, it seems as if the highway has turned and is heading more towards the coast because you're going to have a bypass for Mandeville, you're going to have a bypass for my, um, Spur Tree, but then now you're going to have a bypass for Junction and, Senti and Black River. And Black River is on the coast and Junction is on the other side, closer to the coast. So it seems as if the original alignment has changed. For this section now this is a little confusing because there is another highway that's supposed to run along the coast from Negril to Manchester so you can't ha and this highway is not a toll road though the highway from Negril to Manchester that was announced was is part of the Southern Coastal Highway Improvement Project Phase 2, the second part of the project. The current Phase 1 is to build a highway from Harbourview to Port Antonio, where it will merge with the Northern Coastal Highway in Port Antonio. And the Northern Coastal Highway runs along the coast to goes through St. Mary along the coast, St. Anne, Trelawney, St. James, Hanover, and into Westmoreland, where it ends in Negril. So, the phase two of that project now is to build a southern, is to build a highway from Negril to Manchester. And that's not a toll road. This road is not a toll road. You don't have to pay to use it. So, with the Highway 2000 alignment changing now and the bypass being built for Black River, that means the highway is going literally through Black River. It's just on the outskirts. And Highway 2000 is a toll road. So this is where, I don't know if it's confusion or we probably need an update on the Negril to Black River Highway, but that probably is going to change as well. Because you can have two highways going through Black River. One where you have to pay and one where you don't have to pay. They're going to compete against each other. And who would use the highway pay if you have a highway beside it that's free? So what I think might happen, and I haven't gotten any official notification of this, is just based on what is going on, I think that highway from Negril will run from Negril to Black River, where you then merge with the Highway 2000, the toll road that you pay, and then the toll road will take you from Black River to Manchester. So I don't see the highway from Negril going all the way to Manchester again. I think they have changed it and it's going to go to Black River. That would be the most feasible explanation for what's going on. Now, as I said, this is just speculation. There has been no official announcement of what's going on, but based on the path that Highway 2000 is taking, it is more than likely that highway that, that there will be some changes to the Southern Coastal Highway Improvement Project Part 2 or Phase 2. Which probably is, makes sense. I mean, Highway 2000, you have to pay to use it. So you can't. And then the other highway is free. So it will cost the government less to build a free highway from Negril to Black River. 
rather than taking it all the way from Black River to Manchester because you're going to have to go over the hill and you're going to have to build another bypass for Spur Tree to get that highway to Manchester. There's no way around it. So instead of having two bypasses for Spur Tree, two bypasses for, um, for Black River, I'm just assuming, and again, this is just speculation, I'm just assuming that the highway will end. The Negril Highway will end at Black, in Black River making it much easier and cheaper to complete the highway the highways along the coast the inter for all the highways to be to have interchanges basically to drive around the island on highways so we'll keep you guys updated as soon as we get any official word but the highway that was announced to be built from williamsfield to hodges is a part of highway 2000 some people were saying that maybe that is the highway that's going to go eventually to Negril, but it's not. That highway is Highway 2000, and it will have the Mandeville Bypass and the Spur Tree Hill Bypass as a part of it. All right, guys, thanks for taking the tour with us. Remember to like, share, and subscribe, and also leave your comments in the section below. Let us know what you think about our speculation of the changes to the highway and the Negril Highway running to Black River instead of Manchester. Let us know what you think and if you have any other ideas as to what's going on and even if they could have Highway 2000 and the Southern Coastal Highway both going through St. Elizabeth, how it could work. Alright guys, remember to like, share and subscribe. Have a good day.